crucial part of any digital transformation is actually a workforce transformation. So you have to keep focus on people development and you can do that on a couple of work streams. So first of all, you need to have a clear programs and clear understanding of what do you need inside the company so that you can develop your internal programs to train the people, keep developing them and then keep advancing your technology by using your own capacities. On the other hand, you need to partner uh, with local academia community and uh, becoming by becoming their trusted uh, uh, advisor, you're actually providing them the guidance where you would like to be and what are the skills that are needed on that market or on a global market so that we can uh, contribute together uh, uh, as, as, um, a, as the ecosystem, what, what we are doing. And then the, the finally, um, it's uh, working together with the startup and academia community where you are actually trying to uh, retrain the people on the market and make sure that uh, there are good people on the market that maybe have some certain skills, but you want to retrain those skills so that they become even more competitive. On that way, you're actually boosting up the economy of the whole country where you are actually doing your business, but that's actually helping you to be sustainable uh, and help you also to keep advancing uh, through your innovations and keeping up with the digital transformation. So I think finding the talents is one very important part. Um, and I think that the talent pool is usually something that either attracts or rejects the company from the certain markets. Uh, but finding the talents is only a first step. Training them and working on a workforce transformation through a different work streams is crucial part of success of any company, especially in the 21st century when everybody talks and implements a digital transformation.